Welcome back to Hit On Miss TV, ladies and gentlemen. My name is Ramon. Today on the show, we're going to be watching a new movie called Scott Mann's Fall, directed by Scott Mann, and it stars Jeffrey Dean Morgan. And that's the only reason I was going to check it out, because it's uh, Negan from The Walking Dead. And he was in The Watchmen, Zack Snyder's Watchmen, which I really liked as well. I don't know a lot about this. It looks like on the poster there's a tower. It looks like a telecom tower or something, and two girls are climbing it. That's all I know about it. I've not seen any trailers. I don't know anything about this film. Film, but I just thought, you know what, it seems to be popular at the moment, so why not check it out and see what it's all about. If this is the first time that you're watching the channel, welcome, I hope that you're all doing good. If you're returning, thanks, nice one. Eee. Dirty, dirty, dirty. The fall, well there's two girls on a poster, so he's obviously going to die, right? <laughs> <laughs> he's going to die. I wouldn't climb up no mountain, bro. Whoa, 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 you're good. You're good, yeah? Oh, well, this is that stuff without the ropes and that, isn't it? Carefully, there's loose rock around the elbow. Don't worry about your ropes, bitches. I'm fine. So he's going to fall, and it's going to be the two girls left behind. And to get over her trauma, she's going to try and climb an aerial tower. Taking your time there, Hotshot. I bet there's some of you out there that do this, don't you? You wouldn't catch me doing this, mate. I'll get scared going up in stairs. Like stairs, I'll get afraid. Oh my God, one ring to rule them all. I told you he was gonna be first. He's gonna die. I think I can make it. <laughs> Bye. No! <laughs> it's as if it was obvious from the title. I can't help you if you don't pick up the phone. Sweetheart, I'm worried about you. That's her dad, Negan. Dad, what? Are you stalking? Negan. Every day I miss the way he looked at me. I miss the way he made me feel. Sweetie. Sweetie. I'd rather walk. Let me ask you something. Have you seen Rick? <laughs> <laughs> I felt a bit like this when they delayed Top Gun Maverick for a year. And it's the life-saving phone call from a friend who's going to get her to go rock climbing again. Answer the phone or do the stuff. You know, take yourself out. You look... Amazing. I have something that's planned. And I need a partner in crime. Oh, yeah. I was planning on climbing it this weekend, and I wanted to see if you'd climb it with me. Nah. Nah. You could scatter dance ashes on top. Nah. It looks like a pair of balls and a pipe, and that means it's gonna f you. Nah. What is it that Dan used to say? Don't. Don't fall. Andre, I just I can't. You can. I can't do it. I'm sorry. You can. If you're scared of dying, don't be afraid to live. That's what Dan used to say. She's quite pretty, actually, isn't she? Sometimes you need someone to pull you out of a dark hole. Or to go into a dark hole. Whee! <laughs> what we're doing here, this, is like I'm probably wrong, but is that blonde girl the girl from Zombieland, the young sister? It's not, is it? Looks like her. You see that light way up there? That's insanely high. That's a bit of a strange thing to say, considering she climbs mountains and stuff. And... How's that for a dummy trooper? Amazing. It's amazing, she did it without looking. I get the feeling that her friend banged her partner. I don't know why, because the dad said she's not, he's not sweet and innocent. So I reckon he cheated on her. Oh yeah. I love you. I love you too. Oh, that's a bit of a creepy dream, isn't it? I still have dreams about great white sharks and I'm like under the ocean and I'm looking up and I can see the top of the water and it's just obviously dead silent because of the water, but I can feel the great white and I always think it's going to get me and I wake up. I have that dream all the time. Totally batshit crazy for you guys today. The B67 TV that looks ridiculously high. 
Did you see that coming, did ya? Women drivers. Ah, oh, it's still alive. I don't know why the girl with the dark hair seems to be shocked at everything when she does all of this dangerous adventure stuff, but she seems to be shocked by everything. 350. I wonder how many of your followers are serial killers. <laughs> Here we go, let's see how tall it is. Oh, no, no, no way. No way. Nah, I wouldn't be doing that. Hey, of course you can. No, um, I really can't. I'm like, I'm petrified of like shaking. Go on, kiss her. Deep breaths. After Dan died, I was afraid of my own Tie your hair up under your blouse. Come at it head on and kick its ass. That's what Bob said to Will in Stranger Things. Look what happened to him. Remember? Nah, bruv. Don't worry. We've got 50 feet of rope. <sighs> That's making me dizzy just looking at it. One wrong at a time and let me know if you have to rest. Oh, it's just a ladder straight up. I could do that. No, I couldn't. I couldn't. That is so high. And heights is one of my fears. Can we rest a moment? I need a drink. The skylight seems we're halfway up. That's halfway. Perfect spot. Oh yeah, perfect. Crazy man. Everything's look loose, like it's like a sign to say don't go up there, isn't it? I'm getting final destination vibes. Well I think Blondie's gonna be like be the first one to go, obviously, and leave her on her own. It's an amazing view though. It's not a lot to look at, but it's still amazing. You kidding me, they've got to climb further. Nah, bruv. Oh my God, there is, there's a little bit more. People that do this stuff are crazy. I would do it if it was base jumping, if you had a parachute on your back, because in my back of my mind I would feel some sort of security. So get to the top and then dive off, I would do that. No, I wouldn't. No, I wouldn't. What am I talking about? Remember, only look up. So she looks down. <laughs> Concentrate on something else, like... Your ass. It's all CGI, but it looks good. Nah, she wants a bit more. Oh, God. Oh, I don't know what that is. Start flipping Lara Croft this one, isn't she? That ladder's gonna go, mate. Not for love or money. If you told me there was a million pound at the top of that, nah. She's psycho, bruv. That's not funny. I'm starting to get anxious now because it's really high. The ladder's gonna go, the ladder's gonna go, the ladder's gonna go. Ooh, dear. So when they step on it, it's gonna go outwards, isn't it? That's not a good look, bro. Hell no. Hell no. Hell no. Okay. Now the ultimate vex. Your turn. Fuck that. The old Becky would have done it. Yes. And the old Becky's boyfriend fell off a cliff because of it. She's going down the ladder side. So she's going to kick the ladder and it's going to fall out, isn't it? Okay. 
God no, God no, God no. I want you to look at these and know that you have nothing to be afraid of. I'm really proud of you. Damn, I'll be too. He, he would be proud of you, but he's dead. Remember, because he fell. He's dead. Now, when I die, I want to be put back into the earth so all the little creatures and insects can feast on me. There's plenty of me to go around. Why is she crying, see? Because she f***ed him. I told you. I don't know about you, but I really need to pee. I've needed to pee since we passed the Eiffel Tower. <laughs> <laughs> now it collapses. We've forgotten. Nope, you've got them. Here we go, cliffhanger time. Sylvester Stallone. I've got you. Okay. Oh. <laughs> the ladder's gonna fall out. Here we go, here we go. Bye! <laughs> Nice camera work. Oh, sugar me. Hold on, sweetheart. Hold on to that pipe. Oh, sugar me timbers. Stop kicking. Just like hold on to the pole. We ride the pole. How the heck are they going to get out of this? <laughs> That's, best, that's the best bit so far. Look at this. Oh my God. Oh my God. Oh, they'll come in handy. And one flare. Okay, I'm, I'm sure that there are like multiple calls in a 911 as we speak. Nah. Do you really think so? Nope. No, I don't. No. Just go. That's why you should have parachutes. Just in case. Okay, we have 50 feet of rope. We can try to fish for coverage. Yeah. I just need something to secure this with. My hair tie. Yeah, perfect. Okay. It's like MacGyver with women, isn't it? Get two matches, rub them together, and flick them up, and they turn into an aeroplane. 911. It's ready to post. We should hear it when it sends. Yeah, hit send, and it will keep trying to send, won't it? Clever idea. Are you insane, bruv? I don't hear anything, nothing. Okay, you need to come back up. Ah. Uh, no, 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 no. So I need something more substantial. Oh, Hunter. Dear push it, bruv. Oh, yeah. Thank you, v Take it off. <laughs> <laughs> sorry, sorry. Take it off. Take it. They sense dinner. Holy shit, there's a freaking guy. What did I tell you? She's got some sort of tattoo on an ankle. Please tell me it hits him on the head and kills him. He's setting up a, a grill or some shit. Okay, and we'll fire the flare when the sun goes down in like in like an hour. Good good point, girl. When it, when it gets darker. What did I say to you at the start? This is so predictable. That just makes the story dumb. Are they gonna start having the heart to heart? Why did you bang my man? They can never say the words I love you. One, four, three. Oh, is it one, four, three on her foot? Well, at least she knows now that her best friend banged her husband. Who's in the wrong in that situation? The husband for cheating or the best friend for banging her mate's husband? I mean, they're both equally wrong, but who's more wrong? That's what we want to get to the bottom of right now. <laughs> and then you asked me to be your maid of honor and it all hit me like a ton of bricks. How messed up this all was. Push her off. I loved him. Push her off. Push <laughs> Be careful. I love him. 
oh wow, that means that's a farewell goodbye, she's going to die. That's what happens when they do this in films, don't they? They do the, I'll be right back. No, you won't. Yeah, but isn't the ladder bit just there? Oh shit. Bye, you're gonna die. Come back up. Hunter, no. She's fing nuts. Well done, girl. Hold on to the ladder, the ladder, the ladder. Oh Is it called vertigo when you're scared of heights? Yeah, that's me, vertigo. You're fing insane, bruv. She's like a little, little spider monkey, isn't she? Well done, you. Female Wolverine, well done. Suit my girl. We're gonna figure it out. Okay, there's gotta be a way. Nah, you're not gonna die. Only Blondie's gonna die. You you're halfway there, come on, girl. You could do it, put your I'm back into it. That is so high, isn't it? You gonna be okay? Yeah! I got this! She's got this. She's got it in the bag, this one. Oh, give me a break, vultures. <laughs> she just stood by and watched it. That vulture's mugging you right off. Why didn't you catch the back? Because um. you're an idiot. Could have charged your phone when you was up there, love. Dad was right. It's going to get hit by a car. <laughs> oh, oh, shame on you. Told you. Women drivers, bruv. Women drivers, mate. Go back. <laughs> no, no. No. <laughs> How could you not see a big truck that's coming down the road? The vulture's mugging you off. Oh, shit. Well, at least they'll get some water. But will they get electrocuted because of the water? What? Oh, she didn't make it. Oh, wow. Oh, well, that's a little bit of a twist. I like that. That's the best thing in the film. I love you. Okay, there's your answer. That was shocking. Oh, the vulture wants some. Oh, dear. Grab it by the neck and kill it. Uh. Yeah, gone. Woman versus pigeon. Fucking At least she's got some food. Anyone for vulture? You'd throw up, wouldn't you? She could have put the wings on and fly. No. Attach the rope to the bottom of the ladder and you've got more room. More intelligence than the other one. Well done. She's gonna make it, ain't she? 
Right, well, there's your dead friend. Hello, Vulture. Just at your mate. Yeah. Is she going to push her off? You've got her, haven't you? So sorry, but I really have to make sure this gets through. God, sorry. Oh. <laughs> bye bye, Hunter. That's what she gets for folding for your husband. Come on, Negan. Yes, my G. He's done it, hasn't he? Live your life. You only get one of them, okay? And don't go climbing. Right, ladies and gents, that was Fall by Scott Mann. I thought it was okay. Weren't brilliant. It was kind of what I expected it was going to be. A few twists, a few turns, but it was kind of a filler movie. So if you do see it on streaming services, it's one of those movies to sort of pass time by. Don't expect miracles with this film. It's just about two girls climbing to a tower and getting stuck and trying to come back down again. I mean, we've seen this in loads of other movies in the past. It was just an okay movie, but I did predict it from the very beginning, what was going to happen, and it all kind of done the cliche traits that you would expect it was an alright movie I'd probably give it a 4 or 5 out of 10 it was one of them very average ones thank you very much for watching my name is Ramon this is Hit or Miss TV if you're a new viewer that's just found the channel by chance subscribe join us on our journey into watching films cinema news entertainment and all of that sort of stuff as the channel grows and if you're a returning viewer thank you for coming back leave your comments down below and let's have a chat down there did you like the film I thought it was meh, meh. Make sure as well to go onto our community page on our YouTube. Go onto our community page because that's where I post a lot of stuff where you can interact with me. Movies, you get to decide, like vote what we watch next. I'm going to see you again soon. Thanks for watching. Peace. Thank you for watching Hit on Miss TV. If this is the first time you're watching, please consider subscribing and check out our other videos.